Welcome to a three-part series looking at solar and wind energy on your boat. We have come along to Marlec Engineering, home of the Rutland Wind Charger, who have been active in the sustainable energy sector for over 30 years in order to have a look at the options available for your boat. Marlec Engineering, we have been uh, manufacturing wind turbines since 1979. Uh, we've manufactured over 100,000 uh, wind turbines which we've exported all around the world. We manufacture six different models uh, which come from our factory here in Corby. We're a family business, 25 employees, um, and we are probably one of the oldest renewable energy companies in the UK. Whether it's a 12 volt or a 24 volt battery uh, bank system that you have on board, you can use renewables to, to charge those batteries. So just going through a simple charging uh, scheme using solar panels. A solar panel will produce power just from sunlight, it doesn't have to be direct sun, but obviously the more direct the sun, the, the more power it's going to produce. The way a solar panel is wired into your battery system is very simple. You have a positive and a negative cable from the solar panel that ultimately runs to a small solar regulator, something like this one here. That wires into the terminals, and then from the solar regulator, this would be a meter or so from your battery bank, you then have cables to connect this to your existing battery bank. That's a very simple uh, charging system with a solar panel. There are lots of different solar panels on the market, different sizes. Um, so you can go from a small 10 watt panel like this one here, right up to a 250 watt panel, which you would see normally on the roof of the house. All depends on the, obviously the, the space you have available on board. But they're all wired pretty much in the same way using following all the same principles. There are a range of different solar regulators on the market, again depending on what type of charging system you're looking to, to build. So a basic solar regulator, one like this, probably uh, cost you under £20, very simple to wire in. You have some more complicated systems like this, which actually have a, a digital display on there, which actually tell you how much power you're producing, how much is going into the battery. There are also controllers which are MPPT, which actually produce more power from your solar panels, actually produces a, a more efficient charging system if you have a larger solar array. Watch videos two and three to learn more specifics about how to wire up your wind turbine or your solar panel.